hello hopefuls and thanks so much for coming back to my channel today if you're new welcome to my channel and today's video is going to be about my white dish collection so I have a small white dish collection and I wanted to share with that with you guys today and if you're new be sure to hit that subscribe button to see more videos like this and also I do grocery hauls and family life style videos and hopefully more vlogs and let's see DIYs and just home decor all those different things and hauls and so forth so let's get started with this video and happy fall guys okay so what I'm going to do is a quick pan of my little white dish collection over here and I decided to do this video because most of these dishes come from Aldi. If not Aldi, I think Dollar Tree or Target One Spot. Not too many right here from the Target One Spot. But mainly from Aldi and it's fall now and holiday entertaining is coming up real soon. And the number one question that I get most, and I don't get a lot of questions, y'all. So I am thankful and grateful for that. You guys don't ask me a whole lot of questions. <laughs> so that's a blessing. But the number one question that I get is about my white dishes and where I got them from. And I don't spend a whole lot of money on them. And this is the time of the year they normally pop up from Aldi. So keep your eyes out in the next coming weeks. They have a weekly ad of like their sneak peek. I think I have one right here. You can also download their app. I'm not sponsored or anything like that. And every week they have these when you leave out the store or you can download their app. This is the week last week in these little cabinets. I couldn't make up my mind. It went really quickly. But they will show like some of their cookware they may have in their flyer. And um, I love their non-food stuff. I just absolutely love it. Eyeing this, hopefully this will go down. But yeah so i'm gonna just gonna show what i have i have done a similar video to this i'll make sure i link it above and below but i think i have grown since then so that's the reason why i'm doing this video and so you guys can keep an eye out on what they have um coming up soon they don't necessarily have the same things every year some years they do bring the same things back and yeah Okay, we're going to start over here, and don't mind my wall. I have these, I think it's rooms by decor, rooms decor tiles, that sticky tiles that I'm putting as a backsplash here all the way, and I'm almost done. I just need to do this small wall. I have to reorder it and go all the way around the kitchen. Well, not go all the way around, but just a little bit because I'm almost done. So, I wanted this gravy bowl, and I think I passed on this a couple of years couple of years and it was only guys less than five dollars I believe for the gravy bolt and then I wanted a butter dish so it would have been nice if it had a little handle at the top you probably can glue one on there with E6000 but it's really no biggie because I don't use it all the time but if you're one that use your butter dish all the time that's a great place to get it. I want to say, guys, it was like $3.99. It might have been $4.99, but I think it was $3.99. So that was a great price for that. Back here in the back, I have a three-tier stand. And I take them apart and I put them back together so I can save space. So I am missing a piece. It's like a little silver piece that sits right here. Let's see that sits right here so I have to look for that or either go find a new piece and I like these these are really great for little finger sandwiches or hors d'oeuvres if you're having a little party you can put little cake slices on there um, let's see pinwheels you can put Swiss um, what do I want to say cinnamon rolls just all different types of things on here cookies and so many goodies on here I can't remember the price guys because it's been years this is a collection over time but I know it was less than ten dollars for those they're probably like seven eight ninety nine something like that 
Then moving over here, guys, I have these little bowls and I use these a lot of times for like condiments for a party as well as these. You don't have to use this tray that comes with it. You can just use the bowls by themselves. So if it's like some type of dipping sauce or little small finger foods, something like that, like salsa, sour cream, shredded cheese, shredded lettuce. That's what I usually use these for. But the different ways you can use them is really limitless. You don't have to use all four. You can use two, you can use one. You can mix them up or whatever you want to do. And these guys were probably around about five or six dollars, maybe cheaper. I want to say like four ninety nine. So it the price, all the prices are different and they vary. Back here in the bag, I have these. I think I most recently got these. And I love the shape of these. And these are really great for like pasta salads. Maybe even if you have like soups or anything. These dishes are dishwasher safe. They are microwave safe. And they don't stain. They're really easy to clean. Usually, most of these are all the Crofton brand from Aldi. I'm trying to see if it says it on the bottom. Yeah. So all of them don't say it, but more of the Crofton brand that they have from Aldi. And so these two came together and they probably were like seven, eight dollars. They're really deep. I think they're both the same size. Yeah, they are. So I love to pull these out and especially these right here. Um, this is actually these three. Let's move it over. These three right here are part of a tier set. So I'll pull that out in a minute and show you guys and stack it but it has this large bowl this is again good for salads for pasta salads any kind of dish like spaghetti or something like that or if you have a lot of something like I don't know like a lot of condiments it could be salsa it could be cheese sauce it could be chocolate sauce strawberry something like that and then i also let's see let's put this together and show you guys so it comes with this attachment let's see no, this is the bottom and am i missing one let's look over here this is the bottom yeah i'm missing one Let's see if I can find it. Yeah, I'm missing one. So it's one that goes at the very top, and I probably know I know where it is. It's in this cabinet over here. But what I want Jason to do for me is to put a shelf together, and I'm gonna make make me a little shelf so I can have like a little entertainment. Um, closet or whatever but I'm not sure but anyway it sits up high right here and I'm sure it's not in the cabinet where it's supposed to be but I know where it probably is so anyway it sits up here I don't use it a whole lot because I do wish that it wasn't black and white is okay but sometimes it depends on your color palette of your little buffet that you're doing that you may want it to be a more neutral color you may want it to be all white so I have thought about painting it but I'm not sure but anyway I don't use it with the stand all the time I use it more so with the, just the bowls okay so I like these as well and I like how you can use them by themselves or use them as a grouping and I believe these were like I know they were less than $10 they're probably like eight eight seven something like that y'all it's been a while so sometimes they don't bring back the exact style i don't know if they go based off of how well it sold i'm not sure but i like to use these these are really good for like breakfast time sometimes i'll put like maybe some bacon some eggs in them um some sausage if you're not serving like a whole lot or something like that these little dishes here I got from the Dollar Tree away a while back and you can use these two as little serving dishes or individual 
place settings or something like that and I could have thought that I had at least one more a couple of these but right now I only see two and I also have some that's similar you can make your own little soup bowls um, let's see French onion soup little chicken pot pies just different things with these little bowls these came from the Target one spot um, a couple of years ago and they were like uh, I think a two pack so usually when they have stuff like this at the Target one spot it's like three dollars or it used to be three dollars over here starting in the back I have these bowls here and they kind of go at an angle they don't look like it but I purchased these when I purchased these here so they had these out at the same time and kind of when my collection was growing so I was like I don't really need any I don't get the same type unless I absolutely love them um, which I haven't done that but um, if they do come out like with something similar which I'll show in one second then maybe I'll get another one but I like to get them different sizes different shapes for different types of foods so this one is another one that's really good for if you have grits if you have some type of soup some kind of salad some kind of pasta salad even if it's like sandwiches you can cut them up real pretty and kind of stack them around the bowl so um, fruits strawberries pineapples just different things and then speaking of fruit I'll jump over here this is another one that is good for like fruits I'm trying to see if I had something on my lens but fruits and a veggie make your own little veggie tray put your dip in the middle or you can have like different finger sandwiches you can cut them up and then have like some type of um, maybe some veggies in the middle grapes in the middle to go with the sandwiches just something small and quaint if you're not having a lot of people over right here these little bowls they're just like kind of like these little um bowls here i can't think of what you the formal name of what you would call them but i got these from dollar tree they had these and so i got a bunch of these because i thought these would be really cute to put at each place setting or someone had some type of i don't know a breakfast bowl you can do like little breakfast bowls you can do little um fruit salads or something like that for like christmas or for a holiday mother's day or something like that um chicken pot pie and i just thought these would be really cute so that's why i have so many of these haven't seen them back in dollar tree because they're not a dollar tree brand but they're super cute i like this next little collection they came in a pack of three and they probably were at least, I know, $10, $11 or something like that. Um, it's been a while since when they put these out. And these remind me of the Rachel Ray. Like, if you watch QVC, I think Rachel Ray used to be on QVC. Or when she first came out with her line and she had all these different color dishes and she had these handles. So, these remind me of her dishes and I like these a lot from Aldi. So most of them came from Aldi unless I said it came from Dollar Tree and or Target. Um, these you do have to be careful not to put something in here that may be watery or something. Because this is not that deep as you think it is. Um, it is deep on the side. But I mean on the length side. But on the width side you just don't want to put something in that may be runny or something like that you may want to watch it I did put like some gravy one time with some Salisbury Salisbury steak in them or something like that but I didn't put like overflow it or anything like that so these are great for like your dishes if you're trying to make like mac and cheese um, let's see if you put some baked chicken in here some cabbage or something like that yeah so also over here, this is kind of new to my collection. I don't use it all the time. Um, this is devil egg holder. And I had like plastic ones from the Dollar Tree forever. And I was like, well, hope, you know, since you made devil eggs quite often, I'll invest in you one of these. So this probably was, I want to say this was marked down. I'm sure it was like $4.99, $5.99, not a whole lot. And so when I see them, they used to kind of three or four at a time in a flyer. 
but then I noticed the past couple of years they've been putting maybe one or two or some other type of serving dish or tray it may be wood it may be slate with the cheese boards and stuff but they haven't been doing it as much but hopefully this year they will bring out some more so you guys can find some these are my favorite because they are so versatile you can use these for so many different things I had these for a while it's probably the first ones that I gotten the two because this one comes on the stand too and you see it's the Crofton brand I have no problem with these they don't chip and break I make sure when the boys when they wash dishes when I do use them I'll tell them just leave it out on the counter so I can put it up because they have put stuff up in I have a cabinet designated for all of this and I've had some of my QVC Temptations dishes fall out of the cabinet and break so I make sure and I'll share that in another video if you guys want to see but I haven't bought anything new from that but if you want to see the other like warmers and stuff that I have just let me know down in the comments and I'll do a video on that because I think I have purchased more things since then since the last video not a whole lot but just a couple things okay I'm gonna put this together that's what I'm doing and I always have to think how to put this together can you guys even see nope so this goes with these plates. Another place who has some plates that are really pretty. Last time I checked, it's been a while. So they were quite pricey for me, but if you, I don't know. I think people have good discounts with the Kohl's credit card and stuff. Um, I know Food Network used to have some white dishes at Kohl's. I don't know if they still do. And they were really pretty. I'm sure other places I see them at Marshalls and TJ Maxx at Home Goods, but most of the time I end up getting mine from Aldi. I look at the flyer, especially this time of the year, and I kind of noticed it because when I was starting to cook more for the holiday. Yeah, I love this. So this is we. This will be one that I would buy another one for and they have actually let's see let me fix my camera they have actually came out with this several times i think at least two or three times and if they come out with it again because it was definitely get another one i got this thing on a tripod trying to show you guys that's why it's kind of wonky But what I was saying was I noticed that a lot of this stuff came out around the holiday because before I was really doing, even doing YouTube or even really doing a whole lot of enter entertaining, just starting, I was cooking a lot for my family and um, I wanted some tools to make it a little bit easier. So I noticed they had the choppers, they had the food processor they had the mixers and all those things around this time of the year so the next year i made sure that i paid attention and i was just getting so excited because i was like oh i'm buying this and i'm buying that but after a while i did buy some that were a little bit because i'm rough on appliances and stuff and use them a lot so i did buy some from KitchenAid, from qvc but at first I started out with the ones from Aldi and some things I still have like the um, waffle maker and stuff like that but anyway I love this and if I could get another one I would get another one because I just absolutely love it I love it without it and I don't use it with the tray a lot and I love it with it and I thought I got two y'all in my head but I don't have two so, I'm so wishful thinking. Oh, and then you can turn it sideways like that, y'all. If you guys can see. So, it doesn't have to be straight. So, I like that. Okay, we're almost done. 
child or a student she came by it might have been a little boy I don't remember I think it was a little girl she was selling some things you know usually they around this time they'll come door to door the little catalogs where they have all of the gift wrap for the holidays and all the cookie dough and the popcorn and stuff so I picked this and I don't use it a whole lot but I like how you can use it in the stand or without and what you can do is just put your silverware in them or you can put straws in them or you can put like if you're having like a coffee party or something like that you can put creamers in some um, some stirs in the other tip of my tongue y'all creamers sugar yes yeah, sweeteners so so many different things you can do um, you can even probably put if you're having an ice cream party you can put sprinkles in one you can put what else marshmallows in another and gummy bears in another so whatever you know whatever you're doing for that party this is another one that I would like to spray paint but I just haven't because I don't know it'll be close to the food and then I have some cake stands I do have more in my cabinets cake stands I had this in my dining room I got this from Target so this was in the Target one spot it was probably five dollars and then this one here um, I got this one from Very Carrie she sent this um, to me years ago and I couldn't find it and this was three dollars from the Target one spot I like how um, it you can put it like there in the middle you can use it without it you can kind of put it to the side which I have done that before you want to be careful so it won't tilt over to kind of give it some you know some dimension you can also give it some more interest because it's not right in the middle or you know you can kind of sit it up under each other like that um, that's another option that you can do and that's all that I have guys out that I know that I have <laughs> I do have one thing at the end I have some more other pieces if you guys are just interested in seeing those things and then like these these say specifically it's from the target one spot do not use for food so it's not food safe but these are really cute to like put napkins in mainly I've used these for flower arrangements or to put like at place settings at the table and stuff like that I just had this out so I do I love these I have a couple of these they just around just around here somewhere so I want to get my stuff like all my entertainment stuff like super organized anyway enough of the extra talking thanks so much for watching guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video keep a lookout in the upcoming weeks probably october um november they'll start putting this stuff out on christmas maybe slightly different it may be um i just thought of something else they may have stuff like cutting boards for like cheeses and stuff like that i noticed they've been having that a lot and i haven't picked that up but not to say i wouldn't want to well, I almost forgot guys to say I think I may have said it. I don't know but most of the dishes they stack really well together they stack back up this right here you can take the top two portions down so it can make more room so they stack really good they don't take up a lot of space and then what I do I don't know what it's gonna look like y'all I have my first cabinet here and this has like all of my white dishes in here there's some temptation dishes I don't know why is a ziplock bag in here up here is like some silverware that I pull out during the when I'm having something and yeah so there is some Pyrex dishes right there the clear white clear ones and a Tupperware bowl that's not supposed to be under here but that's where I keep everything it is another cabinet over there that I have a whole lot of other stuff that's kind of awkward because it's the corner but like warming trays stuff like that that I keep so that's it may seem like a lot on the counter but it stacks really well and I it fits under here and I still have lots of room but guys thanks so much for watching as always don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the very next video bye bye